Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to Tim Developing Prospects Baseball. Hope you guys are all doing well out there. Today I'm going to address something that I've been getting a lot of questions about, is how do I improve my arm strength without throwing the ball and without being on the field every day? So today I'm gonna to give you guys a couple of workouts to do to help you guys improve your arm strength and be able to throw the ball farther when we get back on the field. Let's jump right into it. first lift to help us improve arm strength, I just have some five pound dumbbells here. You guys, if you're not strong enough for these five pound dumbbells, you can go ahead and use baseballs or even softballs, okay? The key is that we really work on our form through this exercise, okay? So, in order for us to throw harder, we want to improve our shoulder strength as well as our scap strength, okay? So in order to get stronger shoulders and stronger scaps, we're going to start with a shoulder exercise specifically to strengthen our rotator cuff. Now these stretches also are going to help with longevity and help us stay injury free on the baseball field. All we want to do is we want to get our baseballs, okay, or our dumbbells, and start them kind of parallel to our shoulders, I would say, maybe a little bend in them. And all we're going to do is come straight up with this movement, okay? Notice our movement here, okay, so there, okay, what would you say the degrees on my elbows are? Okay, 90 degrees. We want to get to 90 degrees with our pull. Pull with our shoulder, okay, that's strengthening our, our rotator cuff, and we're just coming up to 90 degrees. Okay, then we're going to go back down 90 degrees, up, boom, okay, keeping it at 90 the whole time. This is really going to help you guys strengthen your rotator cuff, okay, and trust me, this is going to burn, so make sure we really focus on sticking it the whole time. Okay, and strengthening our rotator cuff. For our second lift, again, we're going to need some dumbbells, five pound dumbbells, preferably. Obviously, if you're stronger and maybe a collegiate player, you're going to go ahead and grab some tens. But for the younger people, we're going to use fives. And even for 12 and under, we'll go ahead and use some baseballs. Again, we're strengthening our rotator cuff. We're gonna do what's called a lateral raise. And that is just going to be with our dumbbells on our side and lift them straight up and hold for five seconds. We're gonna go down and hold for five seconds. What this is really building again, is it's building our rotator cuff muscles. So our first one built up the back of our rotator and a little bit of our scap. Okay, this one is going to build the top and the back part of our rotator cuff. The hold is going to strengthen our scap. Okay, so now we're going to build the front part of our rotator cuff. And the last lift we're going to do to help you guys improve your arm strength is going to be the overhand lift over our head. Okay, we're, we've trained the scap, we've trained the top, we've trained the back, now we're going to train the front. Again, five pound dumbbells, feel free to use baseballs. A little bit of, of an athletic position, and we're just going to go straight over our head. And again, how long are we gonna hold for? Five seconds. Slow down, okay? Five seconds up, one, two, three, four, five. Slow down. Do I look rushed or do I look in control? Again, we wanna stay under control. We don't wanna let the weights be all swinging with our body, because the whole purpose of this is to improve our arm strength. So, in order to do that, we need to make sure we're really focusing on strengthening that rotator cuff and scap. So again, going up and hold. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So again, we're gonna go through each of those consecutively. We're gonna do what's called a superset. So you'll do your first one, you'll do your lateral raise, and then you will do your overhead. Those three together are really gonna help you guys get a little bit of a burn, maybe get some shoulder definition, but ultimately help you guys build a little bit more arm strength and also some longevity in your shoulder so when we get back to the field, we're able to throw a little bit harder. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to hit us with a DM or go ahead and leave a comment down below. Hit that subscribe button so you never miss another video. Again, thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you guys are staying safe out there. Keep developing.